a big day we are taking missy pants to get her ears pierced today so we're gonna go to claire's and get her ears pierced so wish us luck fingers crossed it won't be too okay um <clears throat> fingers crossed it won't be too traumatic for her okay um but we shall see she usually does move boy she usually does pretty good with like her shots and stuff at the doctor. So I'm hoping that she'll be okay. So that's what we're doing. Also we get ice cream. And the boys are gonna get some ice cream, so. But not mom. No, mommy's not getting any ice cream. So yeah, I guess I will see you guys at the and mall. And the baby's I'm, one. Shush. I will definitely try to have like my mom or somebody film while she's getting her ears pierced. Um, so I can send it to T and stuff. So, but I don't know if I'm gonna like vlog like through the mall. Like, you know, that's a lot. So, yeah, I'll see y'all when we get there. Okay, we're in Claire's. We have to get Mama's ears pierced. Okay. Yeah, she's not concerned. Which one? I mean, among us. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Oh, Tay. Oh, honey. Hey. Oh, no. Oh, no. Look at that girl. So Let's look. Oh, oh, my goodness. Girl. Look how pretty that is. You did so good. Let me see. She's a big girl. You a I can't. Big girl. Yeah. Let me see. She's a big girl. She's a big girl. We did. Okay, huh? let's go. Okay, I'm just gonna vlog real quick because I'm in the store and it's weird. But we're done with Tay. We're in five below now. The boys are looking at stuff. So she cried. Hopefully y'all will have seen that footage. I was holding her so I wasn't able to record so my mom recorded. But we're done and she looked so cute. Here she is with her little ears. Look at the, look at her little ears. Oh my goodness. She's so cute. So she's chilling now. Boogie back there. He ain't have no clue what's going on. Boogaloo. Boogie. Boogie. What's up, man? She doing it. Yeah, Tay Tay. So, there she is. <laughs> you don't want me to see? So she's got her little. Mommy, her little look what I got. Hello. What's going on, y'all? Happy New Year. It is January 1st, 2023. Does that not sound insane? Like, I feel like every year it just sounds more crazy. Like, the higher these numbers go, 2023. Like, it just sounds nuts to me. Anyways, we're off to Target, per usual. Um, I have a pickup order that I need to get, but... Um, I need to go inside first because there were a couple of things that were out of stock and I don't know Target is weird like they don't, they're not like Walmart Walmart will let you do a substitute like oh this was out of stock do you want to substitute this 
Target like don't let you do this. It just says, "Hey, you're ready. You're ready. Your order's ready, but we ain't we ain't got this." And it doesn't let me like replace it. So I had to go in trying to find a couple of alternatives. So I'm just gonna run inside and get those before I pick up the um before I pick up the actual drive up order. Um, I am solo right now. Ooh, the sun is the sun. The sun. Like, what is the sun doing? <clears throat> the sun is out, y'all. Um, anyways, I'm solo right now. T took the kids to his mom's house and to his grandma's house. They had to pick up some more Christmas gifts um, and stuff like that. So, your girl is solo, which is not normal, but it's wonderful, honey. So, a solo Target trip. Yes, please. We're getting back into reading, okay, in 2023. Like, I used to read quite a bit, um, like, when I was younger and, like, in my 20s and stuff. And I love, like, a good series. But I just felt like the older I got, everything was, like, self-help and, like, all this other stuff that, to me, no offense to anybody who reads those kind of books, but to me, it just sounded, like, boring, like... I want a story. You know what I'm saying? I want a good story. So I am still going to try to read some of those like self-help books. I've never read them. So I'm going to try to read them this year. Like I already um, ordered um, Atomic Habits and it's supposed to be here tomorrow. So I can start that. But I need a story. Okay. I need to be sucked in. I need to be transported to a whole nother world. Okay. And I like like fantasy stuff. Like I don't want to read no love stories. Or nothing like that. I want, like, monsters, okay? And magic and that kind of stuff. Um, and I just... I still feel like all that kind of stuff is, like, written for, like, teenagers. Like, do grown-ups read that kind of stuff? I don't know, but... So, I looked at some books. Some of them were, like, young adult books. I... You know what? I'm a young adult, okay? <laughs> I'm a young adult. So, I'm just gonna read whatever I want. Um, obviously, I'm not gonna read, like, children's, children's books, like, duh, but... I don't know i feel like there's not a lot of fantasy books it doesn't seem like there's a lot of fantasy books for like adults and i feel like all the adult books that are like stories are either love stories or like murdery you know what i'm saying and i don't want to like have nightmares before i go to sleep so i don't really want to read something murdery i don't know a couple of the books that i picked up you know they were kind of murdery but i don't know we'll see so i made like this whole list of all the books that i want to read this year i'm gonna i was gonna start like just by reading one book a month and i think that's still gonna be like my main goal like at the very least i have to read one book a month but with all the books that i like put on my list that i want to read it's about two a month because i did like my top fiction top non-fiction so we're gonna see but I need to do some reading. So, <clears throat> yeah, that's the plan for 2023. Well, that's part of the plan. Just to read more in general. Just to read more books. So, yeah, I'm back home now. So, I'm just going to unload um, the groceries. The boys and stuff, they're on their way home. But I don't think that they are here yet. So, yeah, I'm just going to unload all this stuff. And that's it for today. What's it? It's New Year's. Yeah, that's it for today. Nothing special. I need to go in and finish watching um, YouTube videos. I was watching McKenna before I left. McKenna Walker, she finally uploaded a video. Okay, needed it. So I need to go in and finish it. So yeah, I'll see you guys later. It's Wednesday. Wednesday. Come January fourth. Oh. January fourth. And yeah. 
I'm still just, you know, doing my normal stuff, but I'm starting to take down the Christmas decor today. And that's what I'm gonna do for the day, is just get all the Christmas stuff down. So, gotta take down the tree and all that kind of stuff. So, that is what I'm gonna do for the day and try to get the house back in some kind of order because What is that? Um, yeah, so just trying to get like clean and organized and all that kind of stuff for the new year. It's probably gonna be like a whole month process, but I'm just trying to at least get the Christmas stuff down. So that's what we're doing today. Okay, well, I was going to try to take the Christmas stuff down. I did get, I did get some of it down, but if y'all can hear, somebody is quite upset and it's nap time. So I'm about to get her, put her down for a nap and then try to resume taking all this stuff down. What's up guys? Welcome back to the vlog. It is Saturday. Um, and I'm on my way to Target as usual. <clears throat> but I'm going to look for a birthday gift. We have a birthday party today, so oh, that's what that's what I'm doing right now. I don't know if I'm gonna keep with these vlogs, okay? I just be like, I don't be doing nothing, like you know. I just go Target. I literally just go Target, and even when I go to Target, it's not like I buy anything interesting. I don't know, whatever, we'll see, but gotta go get this birthday gift, and the birthday party's at the park a little bit later today, so I just wanna go ahead and get it, and get out while I can, and of course, you already know, I'm out unaccompanied, so, you know, I might walk through Target a little bit, because I took down all the Christmas decorations and i don't know if i like threw stuff away while i was putting them up but i'm like what happened to all my stuff <clears throat> like my regular home stuff i don't know i don't know where it is all right y'all i forgot to vlog when i got back home but obviously i made it home from target and we are heading to the park for the party i didn't tell the boys where we were going but We've kind of figured it out so that's what we're doing walking to the park it's not that far from our house so we're just walking so yeah it's a little chilly but the sun is out so they should have a good time okay we just put up the boys gold that they got for christmas their basketball gold don't mind all of that but the goal is put up so we got to put it outside it's dark now so they can't play with it but hopefully they'll get to play with it tomorrow or soon but yeah what's up y'all this is a weird angle it's weird to not be holding y'all but i don't feel like holding it right now so we're trying something different but today is monday january 9th um the boys went back to school today, so I'm just, honestly, I'm just killing time um, until they, until it's time for me to go pick them up. So, hello, I just made myself a snack, okay? Ma'am, what are you doing? Chocolate rice cake with Nutella, okay? Delicious. I don't think Nutella is good for you. I'm pretty sure it's bad for you. I don't know. I just discovered Nutella like last year. Like not discovered it. I obviously knew about it, but I never tried it. So now this is my snack of choice. It's on a rice cake, so I feel pretty good, but I don't really know. So yeah, I'm just killing time watching some vlogs on the tube. I finished McKenna's vlog. Like look, y'all girlies, y'all be uploading like two hour vlogs which I love it. I love to sit and watch. I mean, sometimes I need to connect it with something else, like folding that big pile of laundry in my bedroom. That's probably a good idea. Um, 
instead of just sitting on the couch watching them for two hours. But I'd be like, oh my God. Like, I don't think I can do a two hour vlog. I'd be trying to get my vlogs, not short, but like in the middle. Like, I feel like 45 minutes is okay for me, but I don't know. If y'all want longer vlogs, let me know. But like I said a million times, I don't do nothing like ever. So yeah. Anyways, I finished McKenna's vlog, okay? Love watching her. And then I'm watching Arnell's vlog right now. Cause, sir? Cause it says she pregnant. Okay, I haven't gotten to the part where she announces it yet, but that's what it says. So I'm trying to watch it. What are you guys doing? I don't know if it's just me, but I just love when YouTubers, like the YouTubers that I watch all the time, I love when they get pregnant. It's so fun to watch. I don't know. Is that creepy? I don't know. But I just, I like it. I like to, to watch YouTubers getting pregnant, especially like their first pregnancy. Even though like I like to watch McKenna, like when she announced she was pregnant, you know, and she is not a first time mom. So I relate a little bit more to her because I'm not a first time mom, but I like to watch first time moms, like the first time YouTubers get pregnant. First time YouTubers. <sighs> Y'all know what I'm saying? The YouTubers get pregnant for the first time, okay? So like when Nicole got pregnant, I was, I like to watch her videos. Obviously when McKenna got pregnant, Maya, okay, I'm just dropping the names. But now Arnell and Jamie is pregnant too. So I just love watching it. And I like to see like what kind of stuff they're gonna buy for their babies. Even though my babies are, the twins are about nine months now. They're getting close to nine months. What's today, nine night? So they'll be nine months on Wednesday. So obviously like, you know, I don't need newborn stuff, but I just like to see what kind of stuff they're gonna use, what kind of skincare products they're gonna use during their pregnancy, you know, their outfits. Like I just like to watch all that stuff. I don't know why, it's just, it's fun. Part of it makes me wanna get pregnant again, but then I look, I'm like, nah, nah, I don't think so, I don't think so. I wish I would've vlogged my pregnancy more and I had, like, I 100% intended to, like, I was like, okay, I'm going to film this, I'm going to film this. You know, I don't even know if I was vlogging then. I was just making, like, regular videos. Excuse me. If you're a twin mom, you probably know, but that's... Are you laughing? The twin pregnancy, that was... Something else. Like, I have never. <laughs> children. Children. I've never been so tired in my life. Like, I couldn't even fathom doing. Hey, Larry. This is why I don't be vlogging, y'all, okay? Like. <laughs> Anyways, I couldn't fathom. I couldn't fathom doing anything other than sleeping when I got off work. Because I was working that whole time. <laughs> Taysen, what are you doing? With? Anyways, I was working that whole time and I would just, I couldn't do it. I couldn't do it. So I wish I would have, but I just watch other people and watch their pregnancy. So yeah. All right, y'all, we're about to go get the boys from school. But I... I wanted to change the twins' stroller. So usually I have them in their car seats in the stroller, but like I said, they're about to be nine months. So I switched it so that they can like sit like big kids in the stroller. Cause I mean, they're getting, oh, they're almost a year already. Oh my God. So I switched, I switched the stroller. I mean, I didn't really change anything. I'm just not going to put the car seats in there. And I'm going to let them ride like like big kids. And we're going to see how this goes. Because I don't know. But yeah, that's what we're about to do. Oh, look at me. I'm going to wear a big girl today. 
We're going to run like a big girl today. Run like a big girl. 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 Okay, we're off to get the boys. I don't know if y'all can see me. The sun is out, okay? But yeah, the babies are doing okay. There's like a little mesh window thing so I can like kind of see them. Um, but now, you know, they're facing the front. They can see where we're going. They can look around rather than them being um, in their car seats facing me they don't have to just look at me so now they can see and it makes the stroller a bit lighter since i don't have two big old car seats in it so yeah boogie's making a lot of noise so i guess that means he's enjoying it i don't really know but he looks like he's okay down there and tayson is right here so yeah, they're getting to be big. So we're doing, we're we're moving on up here. I feel like I have to buy like all new stuff, like obviously new clothes because they are growing out of their clothes. Sorry if I'm winded, y'all. Have to walk uphill with the stroller. <clears throat> Anyways, so what are all these people doing? Like people literally keep like stopping. And I don't know what's happening. Yeah, so anyways, you have to get like, like we're in, I don't know, what's the stage after newborn? Infant? Is that the stage between like newborn and toddler? I don't know, but I got to get new toys. Probably gonna have to get, well, I don't have to get a new stroller, but this stroller is long. <clears throat> Like it's very long and like narrow. And so I wanna get something either side by side or something where they can see each other, you know? Cause right now they can't see each other. Like they have their back, like they're both facing forward. So like Tayson can see Boogie, but he can't see her. So I want them to sit side by side or maybe getting a wagon. I'm thinking about getting a wagon, like where they can sit like across from each other. New clothes, new like transportation methods. <clears throat> I need to look into the car seats. Cause I know eventually they'll have to transition to another car seat, but I don't think we have to do that for a little while. I don't, I don't remember y'all. I mean, my last kid was five years ago, so starting over i'd be i forget i'd be forgetting stuff i don't know but yeah anyways i feel like you know we're heading into a new phase now that they're about to be nine months and almost a year so i have to get a bunch of new stuff you know feeding and sippy cups and all that kind of stuff so we're just trying out some big not big kid but you know we're trying some next level stuff here today so they seem to be they seem to be doing okay so yeah we're about at the school so i'll see y'all later all right y'all it's me again and i dropped the boys off at home and i'm just running out real quick um t what is it t got home early today so we so I'm just gonna run out real quick. I need to grab some things for the boys. Uh, they need some new headphones for school and then um, we need some formula. So I have to go to Target. And then um, I have an Ulta gift card. So I might go to Ulta, but I need like some new setting spray. So I'm like, like all my setting spray is like gone. Like everything is empty. So, I need some new setting spray. So, we'll see. I don't know. I might go. I might not. I guess I'll see y'all when I get to some store. JK. Okay, I'm still going to all those places, but I'm going to Dick's. I'm going to go to Dick's first because um, I was watching McKenna's vlog. And she had some cute little Nike suits. She had a cute Nike sweatsuit on that she said she got from Dick's. So, 
I'm gonna come in here and see what they got. Okay, Dix was uh, a bust. Like, they had the sweatsuits and stuff in there. Um, and, and like the tan color, gray, black, white, like some cute sweatsuits. <clears throat> I want this clothes. There we go. Um, but literally, everything was like an extra small. Death. <laughs> not gonna work for me, okay? And I feel like, like the style today, everything is oversized, so you know people are buying up the larges and the extra larges to get that oversized look and i'm like yo i mean you know some of us we wear those sizes you know for real and we, we need those but yeah everything was an extra small sorry for the beeping i'm not putting my seatbelt on because it's literally just right up the little curve so it's just gonna, it's just gonna beep, cause I'm already here. I got formula, got the headphones. I'll show y'all real quick what I got at Ulta. So like I said, I needed some new setting spray. So I just got the Morphe one, which I have used for a long time. And I was out and then I got the ordinary AHA BHA peeling solution. I used this like a long time ago and it kind of burned my face a little bit, but I don't know if that's what it's supposed to do. I don't know, but I'm gonna try it again. So I got that. And then I got this NYX lip liner. Oh my God, it's an eyeliner. Bitch, I'm finna use this as a lip liner. <laughs> so I was looking for the um, brown lip pencil, but it was gone. And I mean, if y'all know, there's just like a row of pencils, but it was like in the lip section. And there were two of them, so I thought they were where they belonged, okay? Um, so this one is brown, but it's an eyeliner. It's a retractable eyeliner, and it was the same price. So I was like, okay, I don't know if this is the same shade or whatever. Dang, but you know what? Make your products multi-purpose, okay? Make them work. You can use an eyeliner as a lip liner. So that's what I'm gonna do, cause that's what I was looking for, but I didn't even read it, okay? So whatever. And then the last thing I got was this Fresh Kiss Lip Cream. I bought a couple of these before, but I've been looking for this particular shade and it's always sold out and they only had one left. So this is a shade Baby Doll. I'm not gonna take it out of the package, but it's like supposed to be like a nude color. So yeah, I'm gonna get home make sure the boys have done their homework and all the stuff that they're supposed to do because they are begging to go outside on the goal y'all saw that we got that basketball goal set up we put it outside yesterday yeah i'm almost home so i'll see y'all later or talk to y'all later
what's up guys so we're just ending monday off the boys are gonna get ready for bed in a little bit and me and t are gonna attempt to watch a movie i just put on this peel that i got from ulta the ordinary one and i remember why i stopped using this like y'all it, it's so tingly it's so tingly and it makes my face like feel itchy <clears throat> and literally like as soon as i put it on i was like oh i remember why i stopped using this but it's kind of calmed down for right now but i don't know if y'all can see where it is it's the red peel but yeah it's tingly it's kind of itchy i don't know is it does it feel like that for y'all is that how it feels for everybody or is it just my face because if it's a problem with just me i'm gonna stop using it but yeah it's it's calming down and it's like tolerable right now but when i <clears throat> when i first put it on i'm like no so yeah but that's probably gonna be it for today like i said we're about to stop kissing we're about to um try to wind down if y'all can hear somebody's not trying to wind down so yeah I will maybe see you guys tomorrow. I don't know where I'm ending this vlog at, y'all. It's just random things. So, we'll see. Maybe I'll see y'all tomorrow. Maybe not. <laughs> what's up guys it is tuesday january 10th and what time is it it's like 12 30 um i'm just trying to keep the twins entertained so we put on some gracie's corner that i was just jamming out to okay gracie gracie is fire so yeah the twins are watching gracie's corner i'm about to clean up the kitchen and clean out the refrigerator because it's gross and I need to clean it. So that's what's happening Tuesday. And then of course, in a little bit, we'll go get the boys. <laughs> Thank you.